Hi, welcome back to Rebecca's Travels, or if you're watching my lifestyle channel, welcome back to Rebecca's Lifestyle. Hi, how are you all doing? I hope you're enjoying uh, your uh, day or night as much as possible. Hi, if you're new here to my channel, my name's Rebecca Jordan, and I love talking about travel and lifestyle. Please subscribe, I'd be extremely grateful uh, for you to do that. Um, I upload five times a week on both my travel and my lifestyle channel, and I just love talking about travel and lifestyle. So today, um, the weather in the UK, around North West Leicestershire is cloudy, a bit dry um, and so today I'm going to be doing Travel News UK, 5 Exciting Facts, September 2022, Part 4 and I'm going to jump right in to the first fact uh, which is Berkshire Live, um, Heathrow's um, Spain Axis covid um a travel form for uk holiday makers but some rules still uh, remain in place um holiday makers uh, traveling to spain will um no longer need to complete um a health a declaration form however many other covid travel restrictions uh, still are uh, apply so you don't need to uh, complete the health declaration form anymore but still there's still many other um restrictions it still um again um you'd probably be, be better to look on at uh, gov.uk and uh, find out uh what um other restrictions um you'll need to um obey but um it's really good news that uh, the covid um, travel form you don't need to complete and um, number two business travel news europe uk rail strikes are set to resume um in early october 2022 train drivers at union as F uh, will also hold um strikes um on uh, the first and the fifth of October. Um, so again, if you are planning to travel by uh, rail, and um, then you need to check that your train is going to be operating, um, um at. 12 operating companies um, in separate pay disputes. Um, that's why the rail and train drivers are, are striking and companies in general. Um, and at number three, at Brist Bristol Live, Bristol traffic sees city centre gridlocked as um work on at uh, three key bridges continues so they're doing up the bridges in at uh, bristol so um there's just very heavy traffic around there so you'll have to if you're making a journey to, uh, to bristol and around that um area then and um, you'll need to um allow extra time for your journey whether you're traveling by bus or car etc taxi um number four eastern travel uh, chaos cost to a 66 million wow um the holiday giant said although the disruption has eased since july um issues it still remain at, at some uk airports so you still got it uh, if you're traveling uh, with TUI, you're still going to have to make sure, sure that your flight is is going, etc. And um, again, it may not take off on time, so um, you will have to allow for delays, unfortunately, in some UK airports. 
Um, number five, uh, TT at G Media UK Foreign Office at uh, Lyft. Um, Sri Lanka travel advice. The UK Foreign Office has lifted its advice against travel to Sri Lanka ahead of the state emergency in uh, uh, because that's coming to an end um so or it's come to an end so that's really good news for people that wanted to travel or see relatives um or go for business um, in Sri Lanka so I would like to say thank you for watching and I'll see you tomorrow um, with a budget travel special so please keep watching and bye for now thank you bye